It, it, it lasted for a number of hours last night. There were two rounds. The first round is the one that produced the tornado. The second round has some damaging winds, some large hail. This uh, Dallas tornado, uh, I know you guys mentioned at the top of the news, but it has been classified, rated as an EF3, wind speeds near 140 miles an hour. That's the strongest one of the ones that have been rated at this point. More investigation uh, will happen throughout the day tomorrow. There's the first one. Now, uh, the damage path, I want to show you just how wide it is. The damage path, it all started just on the east side of 35, right around Loop 12. And take a look at this. I mean, anywhere from just to the northwest of Love Field on up to the to the east and northeast of Richardson, that was the, the, the length of the path, the width of it. I mean, the width was remarkable. Uh, anywhere from Webb Chapel locations down to the south, right around Royal Lane through Marsh, and then up around North Haven, northeast of there, Forest Lane, Park Central Drive, northeast of there, we're looking at Abrams, Buckingham Road, Centennial Boulevard, and then up to East Beltline, Apollo Road, and then uh, we're also looking at Jupiter Road. And then finally, off to the east when it fell apart, it was around Holford Road and North Shiloh Road, and once again, that was to the east of Richardson. So that was the first and the strongest of the three tornadoes. Here's the second.